Yeah, well, the Food and Drug Administration today proposing to make COVID shots a lot more like the annual flu shot, simplifying the process to one shot a year. The FDA will decide on Thursday whether to go forward with the idea, and at the same time, researchers are working on a new flu shot that will be a lot more like a COVID shot. Ursula Perry with how new technology is working its way into old vaccine protections. The COVID pandemic required scientists to move fast, bringing vaccine technology that had been studied for years but not approved front and center. And I think that when the world had an urgent need for vaccines, when SARS-CoV-2 virus hit that causes COVID, then it became an opportunity to test this new approach to vaccine development. Traditional vaccines put a weakened germ into our bodies, but mRNA shots like the Pfizer and Moderna COVID-19 vaccines teach cells to make a protein that triggers an immune response if someone gets infected. Researchers take that mRNA template and can encode it for the flu or other infectious diseases. It would also make it easier to tweak during flu season if there's a different dominant strain that's circulating. It's um, a technology that can um, be deployed pretty rapidly. Dr. Obu Agu says the mRNA flu vaccine would not necessarily be better than the traditional shot, but it does mean more people would be protected. To remember that some individuals do not tolerate the already approved uh, influenza vaccine, so this gives them another option. The mRNA vaccine for the flu is currently being studied, and we could have the results as soon as March. Meantime, other studies are underway on other vaccines for other diseases, including Lyme disease, rabies, HIV, and even Zika. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.